You are a family, everyone you're near to, a family, can't you see? Welcome back, y'all. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. Also, if you're new and you have not yet subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you can become part of the family. Y'all, I am trying um, hot and juicy crawfish, y'all. I want to try it. So, I am going to try it. I'm still in Las Vegas, y'all. Still in Las Vegas. I'm trying everything I can try in Las Vegas. Right now, so I, I got me some muscles. Everything is in the bag. And already I'm seeing that they don't put a lot of sauce on their stuff. I have a little bit of my sauce right here. Um, and I got some crawled linen fish. Excuse the, the scarf on my head. I was getting ready to go to bed. But I said I'm going to do a video with y'all. These is little. Tiny, tiny little. Oh, my lemons. I have lemons right here. So I ne I've never had hot and juicy. I've heard people talk about it. I know that they have a hot and juicy in Los Angeles that I have never tried. So they don't have a lot of sauce on their stuff. I got some mussels. Y'all know I gotta check for hair. Hairs first. Um they didn't put a lot of sauce on their stuff. Let me, I want to try it with their sauce first before I try it with my sauce. But they don't put a lot. I got the hot and juicy sauce. Mild. Is what I got. Oh, my camera over there. Uh, Y'all want to try it? Those taste dirty, like sand, grit. That's why Y'all, like I said, I've heard of Hot Juicy, never Hot and Juicy. I've never been there. They at the door. Um, so I've heard of it, like I said, never been there, but I, I see a lot of YouTubers who do it. So I decided, let me try it since I'm in, and I know they have one in LA, but I wasn't going all the way to LA for no, no crawfish or no, none of that. I wasn't going all the way to LA for any of this stuff. None of it. But, um, I don't know if I'm feeling it. These things to me taste dirty, like they have dirt in them. Y'all, the stuff is the stuff is expensive. Some um, snow crab for one and a half cluster, y'all. They wanted forty five dollars. I said you better put them crab back down because I ain't buying that. Put it all the way down. Their sauce is, is good, but um, these mussels taste dirty. Like there's dirt in them. But they have a good flavor. The sauce is a good flavor. And they sell um, live crawfish and then they have frozen ones. They didn't have any more live ones. Those are the ones that I wanted, but she said they run out early. So I didn't get to get live ones. I had to get the frozen ones. Live ones are 15 a pound and the frozen ones are $10 a pound. So I'll probably go back one day and try some live ones. Even though I've had live ones before. Y'all see me cook them on my channel. They came alive in a box. These crawfish are good. Their sauce is good. It's kind of spicy. And the girl did actually tell me that. Um, She's like, if you don't really like spice, you probably want to go um, to, it's called Baby Spice or something like that. I think she said. But I tried mild. They're not like too hot like too hot that I cannot eat them. Oh, I got a potato in here too. 
This is London job. And I'm eating one of them. The sauce is a little, it's good, but it's kind of salty. Yes, I have a um, soda, Daryl. It's sugar free. Y'all want to suck the head? Here you go. Go ahead. Get all of that out of there. You see that? I wish I would. This is Mr. Crab. It's not a crab, London. He was a crawfish. I don't see how people can really like eat this this whole thing out of that thing and it got all that stuff in there. I'm not eating that. It's not gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. With these. London, stop dissecting the stuff. Y'all, this child right here. Y'all, this is not going to be a long video because y'all know I don't eat anymore on channel, on TV. Cooking only. I told y'all I just try stuff. I'll give you a dollar to eat the eye. I'll give you a dollar. I'll give you $20 to eat the whole, the whole head. Just chew it. Yeah, the seasoning is good. The seasoning is good. Those muscles just taste like that. I wish they were not tasting dirty because y'all know I love muscles. I wish they had um, blue muscles. Have you guys ever had blue muscles? If you haven't, they taste better than um. No, no, they taste better than green. I don't want this nasty stuff. And they taste way better than the black. So they are a little smaller than the green, and a, a tad bit bigger than the black. But they are the best ones to me. I've been to one place that had, um, I went to one, one place, place that, that I've been to that had blue mussels. And they have a franchise, like it's a franchise, but not all of them sell blue mussels. Um, what's that place, Javon, I said by your house? Kicking Crab. Kicking Crab. The Kicking Crab has blue mussels. But the only one I've ever had them at is the one in Marino Valley. The one in Corona don't have blue mussels. And the girl told me because they owned by different people. But the one in Marino Valley had blue mussels. That's the first time I ever tried them and they were wonderful. A whole lot better than uh, black. I really don't care for the black mussels. I will eat them, but I don't really care for them. I like the green ones, but the black ones, I mean the blue ones are really, really good. If they put sugar in it, it'll be better. You just bring, tell them to put it on side and then you just doctor it up. When you get home, you put onions in it, sugar, all that good stuff. So y'all, I'm about to go because I was just coming on here to try this. If y'all ever in the city of Los Angeles, Las Vegas, just look them up. They probably might be everywhere. I don't know where they at. But I found one here in Las Vegas, so I decided to go. Actually, they have several of them. I know the one on the strip sells um, actual alcohol. The other ones only sell beer. And I think wine coolers or something like that. But the one I went to was nobody in it but four people. Four people. And she said they sold out of the live crawfish early. They opened at 12. I went there too. So what did y'all only have? Like three pounds of them? Y'all, I'm about to go because London is getting on my nerves. My last nerves. I was trying to give y'all at least a 10 minute video. Let me go a little bit more. I'll go a little longer talk to y'all. So y'all, y'all want to know why I started cooking only? Why I'm starting to just cook and review stuff? Y'all, because I don't eat a lot. And I know that a lot of people watch YouTube because they want to watch people eat a lot. That makes a person's day. I don't eat a lot. I talk more than I eat. So, I decided, and then I get more views on my cooking videos than I do on my eating videos. So, I'd rather cook. I mean, I still talk to y'all when I'm in the kitchen. 
I ain't a regular, I ain't a regular cook who don't say nothing to y'all. I still talk. I make jokes and everything. Um, but, uh, yeah, I know that a lot of people like more of the, the people who eat lots of food. I don't eat lots of food. I ain't gonna even try to fake like I can't eat a lot of food because I can't. I cannot eat all of that. So, I decided I should just cook for you guys. Try some things every now and again. Still have some of your sauce. Linda's baking for my sauce. I want her to just leave me alone. I, um, what was I about to say? I, um, she made me lose my train of thought. You better not touch my sauce. Uh -huh. I know they want to see my face. They don't want to see your face. They miss Miss London. Have y'all been watching London singing videos? She's been posting videos every day, y'all. I forgot what I was going to say. London is working on my nerves. My last one. So y'all y'all might see me try some more foods in Las Vegas, Nevada. Y'all may see it. Or you may not. It all depends. Y'all probably say she ain't got a green screen up. She ain't gave us no pictures in the background or nothing. She just came with a scarf on top of her head. Oh, that's what I was about to say. My scarf. I was actually getting ready to go to sleep. I was just going to eat these and then take a nap because I'm sleepy. I've been up since 3 o'clock in the a.m. And no, I wasn't at the casino. The casino. I was just chilling. I went to sleep early yesterday, so I woke up early today. So now I need a nap. So I put the scarf on and then I was like, oh, I can do a video. And, uh, because you know, after you do a seafood boil, you need to take a whole bath. You can't just go wash your hands. You gotta go wash your whole body. So excuse my scarf, y'all. Y'all probably say, Shell, we ain't never seen you on here like that. You haven't. It's all right. We all family. We're family. Can't you see? All the sisters and brothers and fathers and mothers. All the others are part of you and me. You are a family. Everyone you near to a family. Can't you see? Yeah, I'm about to go. I'm about to go. <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share this video with every anybody that you know. And don't forget to hit that little bell. So that you will be notified of each and every time that I, yes me, post a video. Love you guys. Bye. Mwah. Oh, y'all, don't forget to wash your hands and wear your mask, even though they tell you ain't got to wear one anymore. Wear it anyway. People outside coughing and everything. Put your mask on. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. <laughs>